You know, we know the pandemic has uh, taken a toll on sports and on small businesses as well, but there are some new red flags that we need to keep our eye on now. Jason Wheeler is right on the money. It's not just individuals who are struggling these days. We have seen bankruptcies surging in the pandemic, but often those headlines are being made by the big companies that are going under. Beneath the surface, some experts warn we're also losing a lot of small businesses, by the thousands in fact. Those are not tracked like the big companies are, but we should care about what happens to small firms because here in Texas, they account for 45% of all jobs. And this map shows the difficulties that they've weathered this year by zip code. 76259 in Denton, for example. Small business revenue there plummeted 69% in the spring. Now, many of those businesses are struggling to recover, so the battle cry they have made to the rest of us is shop small. Businesses of all sizes are scrambling to come up with plans now for another expected wave of COVID-19. According to one survey, though, only 32% of companies have a blueprint for handling subsequent waves of the virus. Another 50% say they plan to come up with a plan. If your business is one of them, at Jason Wheeler TV, I've got some resources that might help you prepare to stay right on the money.